Hey guys, Johnny Buck here at CatchWrestling.Ninja. So last night, uh, Juan Espino hit a really nice diaphragm choke or chest compressor. It's something I've hit in competition a few times. Uh, and the way he did it, there, there's things I really like and things I didn't like. And you know, Jeff Hughes looked uh, like he's either on Queer Street or he's exhausted. Um, so defense wasn't super tight. But I want you guys to see some things that I really like for this. So, so here's my uh, UFC 235 uh, chest compressor diaphragm breakdown. So right here, um, he entered with basically, he, he ended up in mount off of a single leg pass type situation. So, so basically Logan's gonna let me cheat and get into uh, get into this mount position. And he went straight to this head and arm choke position, which I really like. I'm a huge fan of hitting the head and arm choke first. If we can hit this option, you know, here, back of, back of our head, look in, drop our shoulder. We can hit this. This, this, uh, most, or not sorry, this, this mounted triangle pretty easily. But he chose to go straight to the chest compressor, which that's usually my plan B, but it's really, really effective. So same thing, everything's good here. All right, and he just basically, just knee switch it across, went straight to this chest compressor and hit this, almost a like kind of neck cranky type chest compressor, which works really well. One thing I like, and, and I'll show you guys how to actually have to defend this. I'm not showing this anywhere else. But um, one thing I like about this is it's, it's a very tight compression choke. It's a diaphragm choke. I'm compressing his sternum through his spine until he's uncomfortable. I actually hit it today. One of our guys we were rolling with, and I hit it a couple times this weekend down in 10 Plant Decatur. But this is, a, this is a move I've had a lot of success with, submitting black belts in competition with, so it, it's a legit move. The difference is, if you look at my position here, right here, my ribs are on Logan's ribs. We're essentially in a 50-50 spot when it comes to who's got control of what. So right here, essentially, if Logan were to lock his hands around my head, we have the exact same move, right? So I don't like the 50-50 odds of that. I've had guys hold me here. Um, it doesn't really do much. It buys them some time. But that's something I like. So I really like this chest compression. But if I'm gonna hit this, and the one thing about Logan locking his hands when I'm this high is, he can bring his feet behind me and arch me over top fairly easily, really disrupting, oop, really disrupting my movement. So what I like to do is essentially get the end of this lever. I decide armpit to armpit. It's much lower and allows me to really roll him up like the end of a toothpaste tube, all right? So we're here, armpit to armpit, Everything's the same. Now right here, here's a mistake a lot of people make. They're like, I'm gonna hit this, I'm gonna hit this. And it's just uncomfortable and we deal with things. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna plant my feet. I'm going to pick my butt up off the mat and I'm going to try and scoop like I'm scooping sand up with my hip. That's what I'm looking for. So one more time, we're here. We get in this position, we go armpit to armpit, opposite foot, and we drive up and we can control there. And that's the variation I like, all right? So I think it's a better control. It's got more, more um, rotation, because we're, essentially we're further out on the lever. So the defense to this, and I've not shown anywhere else, Logan's got this head and arm control. It sucks, I wanna die. So in order for this to work, Logan has to basically put his spine on my belly button. So he has to roll me up right here. Okay. So he has to sit me up. So what I do, opposite foot comes to center. This stupid, I don't want you to pass my guard position. So right here, Logan tries to finish it. Right here, I can hang out in this all day. Like, this sucks a little bit, but there's really no threat of Logan compressing my diaphragm or my chest right here, all right? If Logan goes more to traditional, like really high, so back up, like what else does it? Right here, right here, this does suck, try to finish it. All right, but this allowed me to sit up and play this. And I've had to, I've had guys hit this attempt on me because I think they're cute. Um, and that, that is the exact counter. So that's my breakdown of excellent submission. Congrats, Juan. I think that was, that was excellent work. I like seeing that kind of stuff out there. But I wanted you guys to see my breakdown and what I think some, some improvements on that. Definitely not knocking him. He's a man. But that's something a little more applicable applicable for little guys like me. All right, thanks.